Okay, so just we are going to show a demo. Uh, how can we call a Apex class from Flow and uh, give some input to from Flow to Apex class and return uh, output from Apex class to Flow? So this is sample class. Uh, here we can write our business logic here. In this line, we are taking input from flow just a variable which we will pass from a uh, flow and then we are uh, prepared, preparing one output variable called output from apex you can see we have a map of the string and object result so result report one output variable output from apex and for now i have a hard coded i am returned from apex class so you can prepare your uh, dynamic uh, variable from here after your business logic and the input result dot put variable name and variable value okay and uh, yes this will be uh, described method you can say i am using input from flow and output from flow uh, output from from apex so here is a definition of input parameters and output parameters so this class is saved here and go to flow i'm going to create a new flow and add a screen see user input and add a fill say text box yes okay now i want when user will be input some screen uh, input some value on screen then we need to go in class just see apex here is flow plugin classes just you, you will find flow plugin classes because this class was saved so you can see here Suppose you are creating a new Apex class, then you need to refresh this uh, window. You need to come on this window again. Then your class will be here because in this class we have implements process dot plugin. Now drag this class here. Give a name. Input. You can say input from flow because we have one input variable here input from flow so i am going to assign screen input fill enter some text in our previous screen and of course output but output coming from this apex class plugin output from apex remember here output from apex now create a new variable to assigning this value where message that's fine text in private okay okay link this and i want to add another screen where i want to show the message or variable value coming from apex class say output add a fill display text give it a name output message and what we need to show this value edge coming from apex and what we need to enter a variable previously we have assigned a where message so that's fine link this okay this will be either input first element then apex plugin then output screen save it okay it will be a screen flow yes okay 
saved give it a try run this value is coming from apex i am returned from apex class here you can see our variables value so of course now we will build your logic here prepare multiple uh, you can put multiple variable like something in map result dot put this variable then again result dot put another variable another attribute and of course you need to uh, define the same here like this so i'm also providing this sample apex class and you can build your business requirement thank you